A new dollar general expected on the north side of Terre Haute gets the thumbs down from Vigo County Commissioners. News 10's Brittany Earle attended this morning's meeting and has reaction from the property owner and surrounding neighbors. The future of this lot is destined to stay empty a little while longer. The property was the hot topic at Tuesday's Vigo County Commissioners meeting. Commissioners denied rezoning for a dollar general. Landowner Harold Cipher says the land is already zoned commercial and eventually a business will operate the lot. This is going to be commercial. It is already zoned commercial. I bought this property because it's zoned commercial. That's why I bought this property. And if a dollar, George, dollar store does not go in there, then something else commercial is. The property is zoned C1, which allows for a 5,000 square foot business. The Dollar General would have required a C2 zoning of 10,000 square feet. Melanie Hurst, who lives two doors down from the property, says it wasn't the type of business that concerned her, it was the size. We're not opposed to a 5,000 square foot C1 uh, commercial building. If they want to put one in there, that's fantastic. But what we are opposed to is taking this enormous building and dumping it into a subdivision. Cypher says he was trying to find a business that would have been a suitable neighbor, but since the land is already zoned for commercial property, he doesn't always have to seek neighborhood approval. I do not have to come in front of any commissioners, any zoning appeals. It's already zoned. All I've got to do is you ain't, you ain't submit a site plan and start building. Which means it's only a matter of time till the neighborhood receives a new business. In Terre Haute with photojournalist John Tim, Brittany Earle, News 10. Now News 10 found eight Dollar Generals already exist in the Terre Haute area. Now let's get a